Hello friends, welcome back to our session. So in today's session, we'll discuss about the two options in PowerPoint, that is the layout and design. First, let us open the PowerPoint. So just go to the run and type power PNT and press enter so that the PowerPoint will be opened. And here you can see that a lot of designs available, the predefined designs available. So first start the black presentation and go with the blank presentation and here you can see the layout so this is one type of layout where you can use the slides okay so here this is a slide preview and this is a actual slide and here you can give the title and here you can give the subtitle this is one type of layout and in the home menu you can observe here the layout option just click on this drop down so you will find different types of layouts so you can select to any one layout among these so to create the thing so if you want to create a title and the content you can go with this layout so that here you can simply type the title and in the bottom you can give the text otherwise you can go with the image if if your slide uh, consists of any images you can go with this this one so that uh, you can have the title here you can give the two images or the two contents right so like this we can have a lot of layouts available and if you want to use a customized layout that means if you are not satisfied with these layouts you can, if you want to create your own uh, customized layout so go with the blank so that the blank slide will be created so that here you can create your own layout okay you, you can create your own format to display the content and this is the importance of the layout option and the next one is a design so how to design the slide so here you can see there is a menu in the menu bar you can observe the design option so click on the design so that you will be having a lot of designs right so this is a theme and these are the different variants okay you can select one one among these uh, themes and if you are after selecting this one you can select the variants so different variants the variant means different colors right so this is a blank this is a blank and see these are the different variants you can see the there is a colors different colors okay so colors for the particular theme and also the fonts the effects effects of the particular theme and the background styles can also be changed right see this is how we can use the themes and variants in the design see for example i will go with this design okay and these are the different variants see you can observe the different colors okay you can select your own color and also you can select uh, the different colors see these are the different colors and you can also select the fonts different font that can be applied on this particular variant or a theme okay these are the different uh, background styles so you can select the theme and you can select the variant and you can select the background color or any 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 variant any variant so otherwise uh, you can simply go with the blank you can go with the blank and you can also use the format background there is an option called format background here you can see the solid fill solid fill and you can select the color so that the solid the, the complete slide will be filled with this solid color selected color and if you want to fill the gradient that means a combination that means uh, see the gradient you can observe there is a combination of two different colors so some sort of a shade is there so these are the different gradients so you can select different gradients okay and also the direction so from uh, right corner or left corner or a center the gradient how the gradient should be applied and all these things you can use see the gradient color you can also select the gradient color if you go with this one and go with the directions see so like this you can simply select the this one okay so the type of gradient if it is a linear gradient a radial gradient or rectangular gradient or a path gradient okay you can you can uh, select any one okay and the transparency also you can also use the transparency you can see there is a transparency changing right so like this we can also apply the gradient and a picture or a text texture so you can fill the slide with the texture 
see this is this there are a lot of text textures so you can select the texture so that uh, the slide will be filled with that particular textures and if you want to fill with a picture you can go with the select the picture or you can simply search in the online and you can insert the picture right and pattern fill so these are the different patterns so you can see these are the different patterns by using these patterns also you can fill the slides right so foreground and background you can select the colors for the foreground and you can select the background the color for the background right these are the, all the different patterns patterns so like this we can fill the slide by using the design the predefined design so there are a lot of designs available so you can select the design or a theme and you can select the variants okay you can select the variants and you can fill the background with uh, the solid the solid color or a gradient fill or a picture or a pattern fill or hide hide the background graphics you can also hide or display okay so like this we can simply create a design for the slide and also you can fix the size so this is a wide screen size this is a standard size so this is a standard size this is a standard size and this is a wide screen size so you can select one among these two right so hope you understood the layout layout to display the content and the design if you, you want to apply the slide apply on the slide right so let's stop here and if you are having any doubts regarding this please po try, post your doubts in the comment section i will like, i will try to clarify all your doubts and if you really enjoyed my session like my session share my session with your friends and don't forget to subscribe to our channel thanks for watching thank you very much